Well, is heartbreak worse these days now that we're in the digital age? I bet it would be. It seems likely, and that's what psychologists at the University of California, Santa Cruz, tried to find out. They studied who better than 19 to 24 year olds. Right, Houston's Jeff Marr joins us now. Jeff, you're in the tech center over there. All right, what is this all about? Oh, look at that graphic there, I like. Yeah, well, now that I'm older, I can tell you about <laughs> how we did things back in the day. Uh -huh. We would actually carry pictures of our loved ones around with us in wallets. We'd have it on the desk at the office. And if you go through a breakup, you just take out your pen and you give a little artistic expression of that person. Or you rip it. You know, or, or you just X them out. Or you take it and if you're upset with them, you could just crumple it up. Sure. Or you can just That's tear me. it up. It doesn't, you know, it was so easy to just get rid of a person. Huh. But now in this day and age, with all this social media tech, the person just continues to be around and a presence. So let's talk about the research from this study, oh UC Santa Cruz. What's best? Do you delete everything from that person or do you delete nothing at all? What they found is that those who deleted nothing at all took longer to heal from their heartbreak, but those who disposed of everything regretted doing so. So it's a no-win situation. Researchers proposed a solution, though, for the brokenhearted in this digital age. There's a software program called Pandora's Box. It will scour online profiles for any trace of a former loved one and store them in one place, allowing users to choose which relics of their relationship to delete and which ones to keep. Now, coming back here on the tech wall, Facebook can be an issue because, sure, you're friends with your ex when you're both together, then you delete that person or maybe you unsubscribe from them, but then you occasionally see the person pop up through feeds from other friends. A lot right. of the times you're kind of in the same circle. So I can understand the complexity of this issue. You can delete emails, you can delete digital photographs, you can even delete threads from your smartphone. But if you're a Twitter, an Instagram, a Facebook person, then that person just continues to be around. Well, you left hmm. us with the impression you don't have a problem with this, that you're able to just go ahead and just toss them out of your life, huh? Yeah, I, I don't have a problem. Yeah. <laughs> I've, I've found that if you don't fully commit to something, the breakup is a lot oh, easier. Oh, that's the key, mother. don't fully commit. Yeah. <laughs> right, gotcha. well, I just wanna show this <laughs> Look at this is what Jeff did. Kate Larson, if you're watching, this is what Jeff Moore, but it might be better than mine. Mine was ripped up. Well, I'm sorry, I don't have any X's to speak of, so, so I had to, to use co uh, some coworkers. Mm -hmm. I apologize. <laughs> I All love right. you, Kiba. I love you, Kate. All right. <laughs> Keep it trying. is hard though. Imagine. They're everywhere. Yeah. Didn't we have the uh, promo the other day talking about man up? Just man up, you know, broken romances oh are part of life. There. Just tough it up. Huh? All right. All right, Jeff Moore, thank you. You all know it was my birthday yesterday. Thank yes. you for yes, the birthday wishes on birthday, air. That was yes. great. And they've given me a hard time about my age because yesterday I turned, <coughs> excuse me, I got something on my throat. I turned, uh, <coughs> but forget about it. Oh, it was my birthday yesterday. And uh, you can keep on guessing. 32. But when you get to be my age, you're always looking for that advanced technology to give us the fountain of youth in whatever way possible. And this is a video that is sweeping the internet that I wanted to show you guys for Mars Moments. Take a look, it's called Kaboki, and it is a hair loss treatment. The fibers make your hair appear thicker. The product contains a unique blend of natural fibers that are designed to actually stick themselves to the existing hair on your head. All products are said to be made only from plants, no artificial fillers or preservatives. Not a permanent solution. This is just a cover that you have to apply on a regular basis. A lot of people were asking if this is a scam because it looks too good to be true. These people are set up in the mall and this person with the brush is basically magically creating hair on balding people, but it doesn't appear to be a scam. I've done some research on this. It's a product that I've seen reviews on and it seems legitimate. You have to apply about every day or so and they're selling a I think a two month supply for $29.99. Normally I don't feature individual products for something like this, but you gotta understand, it's getting a lot of clicks. Well, have online. you seen the commercial with uh, Bruce Boxleitner, the, the actor, the former husband of Melissa Gilbert? He does a commercial for a product very similar to that. He says it's a trick that they've been using in Hollywood for years, uh -huh. and he invites people and he, he mentions the fibers. I don't know if it's the same product, but it's a similar one. So it's not yeah. just a temporary, you're saying This that? is temporary, you have to apply this uh, on well, a regular I was basis. Say every day or what? I think every other day. You wow. have to keep ordering these supplies. It's, right. it's sure. a temporary solution, it's cover. Right. mind you, right. but for those people. Look at that. 
for those people who need it, I mean, he this needs is a, a lot of it. This yeah. is a great <laughs> couple uh, of cans. Yeah. temporary solution. How do they get yeah. the color to work? I mean, you just order the the. That was something my color? parents asked me, and I don't know if if it. Well, look, look, we've look, got I mean, an example right there. Did you use this for your yeah. birthday, Jeff? Yeah, I mean, Jeff, <laughs> it looks, it looks great. great. I mean, it looks yeah, great. I mean, they no, really got it. The yeah. only area I would use. Does that it on feel any different? There's no way. This feels the same. This is newly shampooed hair. You hadn't mentioned it. You can pull it. You can yank it. It doesn't come out. Well, and you. Usually when you're out here, there's a lot of glare from the lights uh, yeah, coming we from. We were but today it's glare. down. Yeah. 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 It's got no, more that no look mm. to it. This is all natural. Oh. No. <laughs> well, he tugged on it, but remember, those fibers cling to your existing hair, so right. they don't go. So That's you true. Tug you, on yeah, that all day. You can't, you can't wear this like in a hurricane or mm. jump into the swimming pool. You got to be careful with it. If oh, they boy. survive the yeah. Meyer <laughs> touch, I think it's looks all right. good, Jeff. Looks good. Yeah. You guys want to tug stuff. on it? Or? No, we're good. No, okay. no, we'll take your word for yeah. it. All right, <laughs> all right. You won't need any of that for a while. Well, I, I hope not. Is it looking okay? Yeah, it's looking it's okay. Good. Yeah, I am a little great. older than Jeff. You know, I mean, he is the youngest kid here at the desk. I mean, I, I'm not that far ahead of him, but <laughs> he's good so at sharing toys. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Thank you. And apparently, if he uses on me, just change his color. It would work perfectly.